at the clinic, Chris is open for business. Next patient, please. First in is nine-year-old Shoma with a question about some frightful findings on his feet. I've got a bunch of verrucas on my foot that won't go away. Well, what have you got to say about this, Chris? This sounds like a rare case of I've got a bunch of verrucas on my foot and they won't go away itis. And breathe. Now let's have a look. Yeah, one, two, three. A little cluster of them here. Now that's the big daddy Veruca there. And more up here. That's an impressive nine Verucas on one foot. How do you get Verucas? So Verucas are viruses, so you get them from walking around where other people with Verucas have walked. So the virus has got quite a cool name. Do you want to know what it is? Yeah. It's called the human papilloma virus. Can you say that? The human papilloma virus. Nice one, Shoma. The virus causes your skin to grow in an uncontrollable way, leading to these lumps. But the good news is, they often go away on their own. The important thing if you have a Veruca is to not spread it too much to other people. So when you go swimming, you've got to wear a Veruca sock. When you play PE, you've got to keep your shoes on. And don't worry if you have Verucas, they'll probably soon disappear by themselves. <laughs> At the clinic, Zand is open for business. Can I have the next patient? First in is nine-year-old Byron, with a question about some interesting bumps on his body. So, Byron, why have you come to the Ouchmobile today? To show my warts and my warts on here. You've got two warts. And then they won't go away. What's the diagnosis, Doc? Uh, sounds to me like a case of I've got a wart on my thumb and I've got a wart on my foot and they won't go away itis. Double trouble. Let's have your thumb here. Now that is just an absolutely classic wart. Can we have a look at the one on your foot? Does it hurt at all? No. What can you do about warts? Well, a lot of warts just go away on their own, but for some people they don't like the way they look or they take a long time to go away. In that case, you can either put some chemicals on and that will get rid of them, or you can use a freezing treatment and that breaks the cells in the warts and means the warts die and go away. But as long as you have got a wart, Though it's not really a problem, you don't want to spread them on to other people. So if you go swimming, you want to put a sticky plaster over the wart on your thumb and one over and the one on your foot, and that'll stop them spreading. Your body can need mending in all sorts of ways, and we're going to meet some special teams that are trained to fix you. <laughs> this is Rocco. He's come to see a foot doctor today, and so have I. Take a look at my feet. They look OK, don't they? In a sort of footish way, but look closer. Meet my Verrucas. We've actually become quite attached. Verrucas are caused by a virus, the human papilloma virus. They're rough mounds of skin that grow on the bottom of your feet where it's nice and warm. I've had these ones for a while, but enough is enough. This is Nutan Shah, a podiatrist or foot doctor at the London Podiatry Centre. She knows everything about verrucas. Why do they stick around so long? They like warm, dark, moist places, so your foot is an ideal place for it to live in. Basically, the verrucas are saying, my foot's good. It's like a five-star hotel. <laughs> well, it's time for these guests to check out. First, Nutan has to cut off all the dead, hard skin. This bit doesn't hurt at all. It's slightly ticklish, but it's actually quite pleasant. So long, Veruca. Now my foot's going to get frozen. This is liquid nitrogen, which helps kill off the virus. Now, it is quite painful. It stings. Liquid nitrogen is extremely cold. Minus 200 degrees centigrade, to be precise. That's at least 10 times colder than your freezer at home. And with a few treatments, your Verrucas are no more. With the freezing over, Nutan puts silver nitrate on. It stops any blistering and also helps kill the virus. What we do is we just rub it onto the area and eventually it will go black. Like Rocco's. He's already had a few Veruca treatments. How do the Verrucas feel on your foot? Do you notice them? At first, when I used to step on the ground for them, um, and then shoes on, they started hurting me. Because that's what I notice is with shoes on, it's not really a problem. It's important to remember that this virus is contagious. So don't touch it, don't pick it, and make sure you don't walk around anywhere barefoot or you'll spread it. 
Now brace yourself, Rocco. Here comes the liquid nitrogen. Wow. Yep. Takes your breath away. You've got a really good technique, right? You're just laughing through it, right? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> so freezing over, there's a coat of silver nitrate. And we're both all done. If you've got a Veruca that won't go away, people like Newton are here to help. But remember, lots of Verucas do go away on their own. It might just take a while. So in the meantime, why not give it a name? Mine's called Dr. Chris. Just don't tell him.